Okay, what we're going to do in this one is uh, look at um, portals and how to use them. First off, I'm going to actually copy our little, pap uh, little moving platform setup. Go Control C, Control V, and just drag this over over to here. Okay, we might move this guy over just a little bit more. We want it so this guy can't be reached um, at the halfway point. So instead of um, just starting going through all that, we'll just test him out by just dragging him closer over to this one. Okay, we'll hit on our little um, preview scene. Oh, I can see what's happened there. But just to um, test whether we can um, jump over there, no, we've got no chance. So what's happened, this, this transition um, one is hit, has hit a tile that... that um, which is already 04 and it's overlapping it so what we need to do is just um, pull it so it's not um, touching it now so that should be should be fine now we shouldn't um, yep we've only got the um, the one block and we can't reach over to him So what I'm going to do is um, drag in a portal block. So we'll just drag him there. Okay, and... We'll say we'll put him there. And we'll just um, hit D to, du uh, to duplicate him um, left. Now what this does, what these um, guys do, is when this, um, when your character collides with it, it will be transported from this spot over to this spot. It um, because the the porthole have both got um, zero on it, then they know they they're matching. If I had uh, another porthole portal down um, further on, I'd have both of them set to one or a different number other than zero. So okay, we'll just. Um, We'll just preview that, and as you can see, you can't actually see the portal. We know that the the portal is somewhere around here, so um, right. So he's been transported there straight away. But no, notice how he's um, he's warped. And he's got a he's got a funny shape, and what that is is because we um, we shape the portal to a different. Um, so we'll just kill this guy for now. We've got this at a 
at a strange shape. So, um, we want to set the scale to 1 and 1. We also want to put something here that's um, going to be notice noticeable for him to jump on because at the moment it's invisible and um, really you, you can't... You come along and you think, well, what do I do here? I can't reach over it. So you'll, you need something... something to overlay on the top of that so what I've got usually it's just a jewel or something something that um, indicates it's a portal so um, what I'll do is I've got my um, I've got my own little um, animation that I, I did this years ago drag this object in and we'll we'll say just flatten him out a bit so it indicates like he's uh, some sort of um, now what we want to do with this object is don't set it to a platform we just want it as um, decoration and that's all it does it just sits there and looks pretty. So we'll just scale that up a bit more. And what we'll do is we'll we'll just drag him over to this one as well. So we'll duplicate this and just put him on uh, on the top of this one. So that indicates um, that the that's where he'll jump out of. Okay, we'll hit, and these guys are running a bit fast. So, so over here, we'll just click on that. We'll go. Um, on our little um, edit button here speed I'm thinking we'll go down to 0.3 and we'll just maybe just 0.5 yep that'll do then we'll just hit our preview button again. Obviously, you can you can have better looking um, assets than that. I've just thrown in something quick, just to demo. So we'll jump here. Or oh, missed it. So um, and you're also going to have to time it. Um, So no, I didn't time it that well. I might actually raise this guy up a bit, a bit higher too. I'm thinking I can just um, run on that. No, missed it. So, but you get the the idea of it. Is um, he's going to have to time his jump when when this um, block is falling right underneath the the porthole there.
now I can't do it so but but that's um that's portals and um, the basic um, part of portals um, this radius is usually um, the distance between in pixels between the portals that it tries to look for another one and it, it will be looking for one with the group ID 0 on it so um, that will um, that should cover the um, portals it's just another little extra that that you can put into your um, um, scenes just for a bit of variety so um, on to the next one